Hi, and welcome to this video on the San Miguel Hulog in Saka. So, in this video, I'm going to be uh, demonstrating three different varieties of Hulog Saka the single stick version, the double stick version, and the stick and dagger version. Okay, so three different methods for using Hulog and Saka from the San Miguel system. Now, Hulog means downward movement. So, the first strike in the Hulog sequence would be a diagonal downward strike. Saka is upward movement. So the first movement within the sequence is an upward Saka strike. So just to recap, this is Hulog, and going upwards is Saka. And these two sequences of Hulog and Saka feature throughout the San Miguel form. And in fact, they're crucial to the progress of the form as they are the linking movements between each of the 12 sets. So today, we're going to be looking at San Miguel, Hulog, and Saka. Okay, so first up we're going to look at Hulog and Saka using the single stick. So we're going to start in this kind of back stance position. Okay, so you want to start with your feet in a T-shape and take your right foot behind you and sit back down in it. Okay, so it's very similar to the karate back stance. So your weight kind of wants to be over towards the rear leg. Your stick is going to be low down behind you. I know most of the time we start striking like this. However, for the San Miguel system, we're going to be starting from here. And the first move we're going to do is a hulog four count sequence to start with. So I'm going to step back and I bring my stick straight down on a uh, forehand downward diagonal strike. Once I get to the bottom, I'm going to do a backhand redondo or flywheel strike followed by a backhand downward diagonal strike and then an upward diagonal strike back. Okay, and we go back to position. So there's four movements. One, two, three, four. Again, as I go back, I go into a front stance. So my weight is predominantly now on my right leg. So there's one, flywheel, diagonal and back up. Last time, position, one, two, three, four. Now from here we're going to do cross step stance. So my right leg is going to come straight back behind my left. And I put the heel down on the floor. It's not up on the toes. The heel needs to be flat down on the floor. My weight is slightly forwards. From here I'm going to do two flywheels and a half strike or media. So from here again, one, two, media. And now I do a two step forward step, one, and as I do the second step, I'm going to circle the flywheel and a diagonal slash. So from the beginning, one, two, three, four, cross back, two flywheels, media, half strike, then two steps forwards with a flywheel, diagonal slash. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And we're back where we started. So this is Hulog with single stick. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now when you do the flywheel, you can do one, you can do two which is what we use as our baseline. You can do three, it's fine. In fact, you can do as many as you like. One of the great things about the San Miguel form, although there is a set way of doing it, it is also open to a little bit of interpretation. Uh, so you can um, increase the number of repetitions that you do of certain movements. So last time for Hulog, back stance position to start with. You step back, one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. And we're up. So that's Hulog. Next is Saka. The movement is exactly the same. The only thing that changes is the very first movement. So instead of the stick coming down on that first beat, we're now going to bring the stick up on a forehand upward diagonal. So as I step back, I strike upwards. Then I complete the other three movements, and again we step back, flywheel, half strike, 
and Uno Dos or um, uh, one, two, fours. And again, for Saka, one, two, three, four. Cross back. Two redondo, medium. And then Uno Dos. And again, last time. Saka, up, two, three, four. Cross back, one, two, medium. Uno Dos. So that's Hulog and Saka using the single stick. I'm going to do it at a slight angle so you can get to see a little bit clearer maybe. So from my position, for Hulog, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Then we go Saka, up, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Uno Dos, eight, nine. So that's Hulog and Saka using the single stick. Next we'll be looking at Hulog Saka using double stick.